In this video, I'm going to be teaching you exactly how to release trauma very easy, very simply in order to forgive so that you can move on. Welcome back to another video, I'm Maximilian, I help entrepreneurs reprogram their mind, empower their lives to live happy, abundant, joy, fulfillment, success, you name it, I'd do it. So as I said, I'm going to get in very quickly into this technique because it's a very simple technique that you can use in order to completely let go of everything from your life. So, first of all, understanding forgiveness as a whole. Forgiveness or anger, anger and bitterness, let's start there. Anger and bitterness is just like someone else pouring you a cup of poison and you choosing to drink it, even though there's a glass of water next to it, a glass of clean, refreshing, beautiful water, but you choose to drink the poison. Now, you may not consciously choose to drink this poison, but what I want you to understand is that you have the two options. You could choose forgiveness, which is the water, which is the clean, which is allowing you to refresh yourself. You could choose that love and empathy for them, because realistically, if they've wronged you in the past, they're the ones that are going to have a terrible life realistically because no one's gonna like them you still got people that like you you still got people who love you so I'll get into the technique very quickly and it really is just about you don't need them to to fully forgive them you don't need to fully forgive them all you need to do is do it in your mind and it's all about a visualization based technique now if you've watched my previous video about self-hypnosis you can get yourself into a very deep state of self-hypnosis i'm sure i'll probably do more in the future but if you need to get yourself into that really deep state of mind into theta theta brainwaves once you're in a theta brainwave you are very very suggestible very susceptible to changing your your neuro pathways in your mind so the technique starts like this get yourself so step number one Drop yourself into a very, very relaxed, a very deep state of relaxation, meditation, hypnosis, really, really deep so that everything is cut off. You want to get to a deep state. Give yourself at least 5, 10, maybe even 15 minutes, depending on how much you, you meditate. Once you've done that, you can then understand everything. You can rationalize. You can create. You can think outside of the box. And if I ask you right now, how many ways can you get from your kitchen to your living room? How many ways could you think? Now, I guarantee you, you didn't actually think, go out the back door, get a bike, drive to the, uh, ride to the airport, get on a plane, fly to Mexico, fly back, get a taxi all the way back, then do a roly-poly through the, through the walkway. Highly doubt you believe that. <laughs> you, you thought of that. And if you did, then fair, you're as crazy as me, and that's pretty cool. So... Once you've got yourself to a really still state of mind, the next step is really allowing yourself to feel the emotions that this person has caused you. If they've caused you anger, feel the anger. If they've caused you pain, feel that pain. If they've caused you to, to feel that bitterness, feel that bitterness. Give yourself 5, 10, 15, maximum, maximum 30 seconds. But really feel it. If it's anger, feel that anger. Let that anger build up. Let it build up. Let it build up. Let it build up. Let it build up. Then see them. See them in front of you. See them in front of you. And I want you to release it. Maybe you're putting down a bag of rocks. Maybe you're letting go down a slide. Or maybe you're cutting a ball from your chain. Whatever it is that resonates with you most, then I want you to do that. Once you've done that, I want you to look that person in the eyes. I want you to say to them, I forgive you. What you've done to me was awful. What you've done to me was unforgivable. But I do forgive you. Because in order for me to move on, I need to let go. In order for me to have fun in life, just like the slide analogy. If you're sitting at the top of a slide and you hold onto that slide, you're not going to enjoy that slide. You're going to cry the whole time. Imagine that, a kid crying at the top of a slide because they're scared to go down. Little do they know, as soon as they let that let go, let it flow, they're going to enjoy it. Naturally, they're just going to enjoy it. And you have that ability. You can do that today. All you have to do is let go of the feelings, of the grudge, of whatever you've got against that person. Shake their hand, hug them. You need to make this real. Bring in your senses. Really see them. Really feel them. Embrace them. Maybe even if they've got a certain scent. Maybe they, they used to wear a certain aftershave or a certain perfume. Or maybe even B.O. <laughs> And really just bring in all the senses, all of the senses, as much as possible. Hear their voice. Hear, hear the noises when you hug someone, <laughs> if there's any noises, maybe they're wearing a rain jacket. <laughs> really bring these senses in 
and you have to do this often. This isn't just like a one-time cure-all because some, well, depending on how hard the grudge is against that person, because if it's a very quick grudge that you want to get rid of and it's just something that they've hurt you once, it's a lot easier than if someone's traumatically hurt you through the rest of your life. So I understand that. Don't get me wrong there. Don't get me wrong. So understand that you can let go of these grudges, these anger, this bitterness, this pain, this guilt, this hurt, this shame by forgiving in here doesn't have to be in the external world because once it's done in here it's familiar and I like I say in every video once it's familiar it's you you want to create confidence you create that in your mind it's, co it's, it's familiar for you and you are a confident person once you forgive that person they will not hold you back anymore they they will they just can't they'll try all that they can they'll throw their lassoes around you be trying to reel you in and you'll just be going no thanks you'll be on fire and they'll just be burning off and you'll just be like yeah it'll be awesome and that's the least you deserve. So I hope this video has given you a really deep understanding of how you can forgive those who have hurt you in the past. Do they have a right to hurt you? Nope. Do they have a right to hold on to you for the rest of your life? Nope. Do you have a right to let go and live your best life? 100%. Can I do it for you? Nope. I can give you all of these tools. I can hypnotize you. I can do all the work. But if you don't want the change, that's the difference. If you don't want the change, nothing's gonna change. I can help anyone change to whatever they wanna to change to, if they want the change, or if I give them enough leverage. <laughs> if, if there's enough leverage there, it's very simple to do so, <laughs> very simple. So, but at the end of the day, that's down to me. So if you feel like I could really help you, and maybe you're just struggling with it, or maybe you've already got the motivation, you're just like, I just need that boost, I just need that pow. Come speak to me, send me a message, find me on Instagram, at Maximilian with I L L I is a one 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 send me a message get in contact let's do it i'll give you a free subconscious mind and an analysis and we can change your life so have a great day i hope you've learned something from this video if you learned something like this video smash it i want to create as much impact power and empowerment in the in the world happiness and fulfillment you name it i'm here to do that the only way i'm going to do that is if i get your support and I really, 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 really appreciate that. So have an amazing day. Keep smiling, spreading kindness, love, and positivity.